Welcome to MCC Pilot Log. In this video tutorial, we will explain to you how to set up the software on different computers. These computers can be PC, Mac, or a laptop. In this lesson, we will first show you how to set up the device list. Next, we will transfer the database from one computer to the other. Finally, we will show you how Sync works. You can use MCC Pilot Log on different devices, such as your desktop computer or your mobile application. All these devices synchronize data through MCC Cloud. In order to use a new device, you have to first add your device to the device list. You find the device list on the settings page. This list shows all your devices that are linked to MCC Cloud. Right now, this PC is not added, so let's add it. You select the type of PC from the list, and you add. The PC will then show in the list, and it has received a unique sync ID. This ID will range between 10 and 99. In version 3.6 from MCC Pilot Log, the sync ID ranges from 1 to 9. On the second computer, you repeat the same steps. When you open the settings page, you will already see the first computer, while the second computer is not listed yet. So you can add it too. For instance, this will be a PC laptop. It's not really important what name you choose, as long as you stay within the same category. So PC Home or PC Laptop would both work the same. From this page, you can also add mobile devices, but we're covering that in another video tutorial. These boxes here stay empty for PC and Mac, as they're only used by mobile applications. After adding the devices to MCC Cloud, you can now transfer the database. You have to keep in mind that MCC Pilot Log is a standalone application on your desktop, so the database is located on your computer, not in the cloud. That means if you want to use a second computer or laptop, you need a copy of your first database. These databases are then synced through MCC Cloud. So, this is your PC, and you have logged a lot of flights. This is your new installation on the MacBook, with an empty database. To transfer the database from the first computer to the second computer, you will upload a backup to MCC Cloud. Next, we will download the backup to the MacBook. As from now, both databases stay in sync. From your desktop, you go to the Tools page, Backup, and you force a backup to MCC Cloud. You can simply do so by clicking the yellow icon. On the second computer, you will now download the backup from MCC Cloud. Select MCC Cloud from the list, and press the Retrieve button and continue with Install Backup. The backup is now installed, and your second computer is now showing all flights. After duplicating the database from the first computer to the second computer, all databases stay in sync automatically. This is handled by MCC Cloud. The software will automatically transfer any change from one computer to the other computer. The software will automatically sync with MCC Cloud any time you start the program and when you close the application. You can also manually force sync from the sync page. Thank you for watching this video. You'll find more information on the website 
or in the user manual.